Hello everyone, welcome to the video review and unboxing of the Microsoft Comfort Curve uh, 3000 Cortic Keyboard. Alright, so in this uh, video I'm going to show you uh, my thoughts on the design, feel the keys, and comfort of this keyboard. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, take a look at this keyboard. So I'm going to fast forward a little bit because it took me a little bit of time to open this. So just bear with me a little bit, just opening that. Alright, so here's the keyboard. Very uh, nice, glossy finish around the keyboard. Uh, I like that it's very dark. Uh, the keys, of course, is a, it's a normal black keys and um, white lettering. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and take off the protective film to give you a better idea of how it looks. As you see, it's very sleek. Uh, keys are low profile. Uh, the keys are the same size as a standard keyboard so there aren't too many changes so we'll go ahead and try the keys so all the keys they feel very quiet very comfortable uh, the letters and the keys and the space bar all feel very quiet and so trying the other keys the, the arrow keys are a little bit louder than the rest uh, but for the most part it's still very quiet function keys uh, all feel good uh, on the top right, there's a calculator button, uh, play and pause button, and the volume control. Again, the keys are very quiet, and uh, for the most part, very comfortable. Alright, so uh, here we have the USB cord. Uh, as you see here, it's pretty thick. Uh, it's nice and strong. Alright, so I'm going to show you uh, the side of the keyboard. On the side, you, s you notice a slight inclination uh, that gives the wrist rest a natural resting position um, from the back. You notice a slight uh, rounding from the top, and the peak is um, the peak of the incline curve is roughly where the T key is. All right, so uh, just one drawback about this keyboard is that it takes a little bit of time to adjust to, uh, especially if you haven't tried a curved keyboard before. Uh, another drawback is that the keys are low profile, so uh, may not be the best for a fast touch typists. Uh, the keys don't spring back up as quickly. Uh, but in summary, a very quiet keys, comfortable and sleek design. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, thank you for watching.